Hello everyone, V just a three to back again for another review. Today it's the bicycle carnival from collectible playing cards. Alright, so this is the bicycle carnival from collectible playing cards. It's all about carnivals. Uh, including uh, you'll see you'll see designs related to pinwheel tents and Ferris wheel. And you'll see stars bursting from the pips. It's all custom. Well, modified custom if you will uh, oops put this away <laughs> and um there was 1100 produced so let's look at it bicycle obviously uh, since 1885 on top carnival playing cards on the bottom you see the tents you see the ferris wheels the merry-go-round in the back here as well as roller coasters it's all about the carnival custom pip ericus and finis on one side yeah, it's just point card company on the other. Uh, I can't see if it says anything on top. Bottom, just some ad copy. It says it's designed by Juniori Satyanagar. It would not hurt collectible point cards to find some new designers. The back, you see the bad design, which features the merry go round and all sorts of other details. The Ferris wheel, lots of stars. It's got a nice custom numbered seal. Uh, this one I got is 689 out of 1100. And hidden bicycle trademark stuff on the flap. Standard USB C tuck case, of course. Uh, collectible playing cards and card. There's your bat design purples and reds and blues, all sorts of color. You do get a double backer. Your jokers are kind of traditional collectible cards. Joker, Joker in the corner, this one in purple colors. And the other one is in red and well kind of pink colors the guy joker in red kind of pink and purple colors as well very simple simple ace of spades custom pip custom indexes as well or custom pip in the index court cards are just a kind of a modified recolored standard court card custom pip custom background and then the rest is just standard so I'll show you just a few. And then custom pips on a number of cards with a straightforward pip design orientation, if you will. Uh, bicycle stock, Ericus and Finnis, as was mentioned, I believe. At least the tuck says Ericus and Finnis. Fairly straightforward. Uh, overall, for what it is, I'm going to say... Let's say six out of ten, or six and a half out of ten. It's not bad. It's okay for what it is. It handles pretty good. Uh, fairly straightforward. It could be used for whatever you want. Pretty much cards, magic. Um, but you know, it's fairly straightforward and standard. So I get, it's okay for what it is. Not one of my favorite decks, but it's not bad. So that is that. Uh, comment, rate, subscribe. Let me know what you think. I will see you next time for more. Thanks for watching.